Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can quickly crop an image using Photoshop. So here I have an image and here I have a cropped version of this image um, and I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm going to use this image to show you and um, the first thing you need to do is find the crop tool. It can sometimes be hidden. So if it is, if it's not on one of your options down the left hand side, click on the, the, the bottom one or there might be three dots on yours and then a whole bunch of new tools will appear, ones that are hidden and you're looking for that one. It says crop tool and it looks like that. Okay, so choose the crop tool. Right, now there's a couple of ways you can do this. So you can drag the sides in um, and when you're happy that it's, it's the shape and it's cropped out everything you don't want to see, you can press enter. So that's one way that you can crop. I'm just going to go backwards. I'm going to show you another way. You can, instead of dragging the sides in, you can click and drag onto the image and it will select a portion of it. And again, press enter and that will crop. And I've tried to create a square there, but it won't be a perfect square unless, and this is the final um, way you can do it, is you can click but hold shift down on your keyboard at the same time. So click and shift. And when you do that, you will your um, crop tool will be constrained to be exactly um, the same height and width, and you will get a perfect square. And you will get a perfect square so here I have a perfect square now let's say I clicked and dragged and I thought it was okay but I actually wanted a bit more of that little picture in there that little painting so you can then click and drag your image that's underneath it around your cropped area until you find the exact spot in which you want to place it and then press enter and there you have it a cropped version of your image and then all that's left to do then is to save it by going to file export and export it as a jpeg or a png um, and that's it have fun